Hello there, this is Rom Wills coming back at you with yet another couch video. <laughs> Once again, a long time, I gotta read this joint. Make sure you're getting something positive out of a relationship. You know what? This is very important. This is very important. Now, I've said it before. If you're in a relationship with a woman, she needs to be either an asset or a liability. But one of the things I'm seeing out here, a lot of guys, they're giving, 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 but they ain't really getting anything positive out of it. Let me use that thing with the money thing. Now, guys are calling them simps or whatever, but that's a major issue. In fact, many guys leave with their money. So they spending a lot of money on these women, but not getting anything. You know what? I remember back in the day, it was this guy. Now, he owned some stuff. He had some real money, right? And he was telling me, like he had went out with this fine woman, this baddie, right? Spent two hundred dollars on her. Now in ninety late nineties money, that's a lot of money. I don't know what it, the equivalent is now, but that's still a lot of money. And then he spent two hundred, then another two hundred, and he didn't get a kiss from her. I'm like, why you spend all that money? First of all, I was looking at him. I'm like, I ain't, first of all, I ain't had money spent like that. I had just enough money to keep my bills paid, keep me in a, like a nice apartment and keep my car note paid. That was about it back then. But, you know, one of the things I said, I thought, I was like, 400, what you getting out of it? You know, seriously, even for the money guys, it's like, what you getting out of it? Like, if you in a relationship, you need to be getting something out of it, something. And it need to be at a minimum equal to what you've given her. I'm saying at a minimum. Now, if it's more, she's giving more than you giving her, well, you know, maybe she need to go around to one of these women's channels or something. I don't know. But here's the thing. You got to ask yourself, what is she giving me? What am I getting out of? Okay, yeah, I'm hanging out with this bad woman, right? And let me use that as an example, because you get a lot of guys, they'll spend money like crazy on some baddie. Oh, she fine. She in her 20s. She ain't hit the wall yet. Okay, you walking around, and what are you really getting? Okay, maybe some people who know you might see it like, yeah. Okay, what's that doing for you in the long run? No, nah, seriously, I want y'all to think about it. You, you impressing, you think you're impressing that person. They might on the surface be like, yeah. Deep down, they'd be like, why she with him? And they, uh, you might even get some people scheming to get you, get her from you. To get her from you. You got to think about this. I want you to think about what you're getting out of. Okay. First of all, and that's even who's paying attention. Because some people, some people who got uh, stupid, they might be like, nah, she just using him. Making you look bad. Or she flirting behind your back. You think you out at a restaurant thinking, yeah, she fine, but... Somebody over watching y'all saying, hold up. She been she been looking at she been looking around. She been looking at her phone and everything. Really making you look bad. A lot of guys looking bad. What are you getting out of it? Look, I'm gonna tell you something in a relationship. You need to be going forward on all areas of your life. Not just even just getting the sex. I'm, I'm gonna get into the sex part in a bit. But just are you making more money being with her? Are you making more, seriously, you got to ask yourself that. Are you making more money being with her? Are you becoming a better human being being with her? Are you, are you getting weller being with her? Like you don't have any stress. Is she bringing you peace? Which, let me go on a tangent real quick. You got some, I've I seen a couple of videos or the surface of a couple of videos talking about that. Like men shouldn't be uh, looking for a woman for peace. And really, you shouldn't. You should be at peace with yourself. But if that woman coming into your space, she don't need to be bringing chaos. That's the bottom line. And that's something, too. Is she is she bring you peace? She bring you chaos. That's you got enough stress. If you if you a man, you trying to be a sovereign man. That means you working on a job, got your business going, doing something. You on your mission. You don't need a woman bring you stress. Is she bring you stress? Is she making it hard for you? Is your life easier with her? And then let's get to that sex part. Let's be real. Let's be real. A lot of guys, they, they spend a lot of money on some women, being around some women. She give them just enough. She just give them just enough. Meanwhile, 
Yeah. Since I had the stroke, I ain't did it. I ain't did this in a while. I usually do these with the car videos. Hey, Joe Roughneck. Hey, what's up, man? Here it come. Yeah, a lot of guys got that that woman. They double back home, and you know some other dude tearing her up in the in the in the apartment he paid for. The you know on the bed he paid for, and all of that, and just some dude, some little broke dude can't even keep a minimum wage. Y'all gonna look back, and be like, my bad. This you man? Shit. Let me finish this up. <laughs> hey, but seriously. You got to ask yourself, is this the type of woman? Because you get a lot of, I'm going to tell you what, with a lot of guys. A lot of guys got that mindset of give, give, give. And it's nothing wrong with giving if you're getting something in return. There's nothing wrong with giving at all. But if you're not getting anything in return, what's she giving you? You know? Like I talked about last week, you got these women, they want a man making all this money, but they can't even make him a meal. They can't even, like, massage his shoulders or something. They just want to take, 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 and they saying it. And if if they average looking, okay, they probably ain't going to get no play. But if they find, you know they're going to get some play. Let's be real. These women that be on uh, TikTok, IG, whatever, OnlyFans, men just giving them shit, giving them shit. I'm like, what y'all giving me? You know? And that's how you got to be. You got to be selfish in that. You're in a relationship. First of all, your main relationship is with yourself. Your main relationship is with yourself. You can't be with a woman who is is violating that. Because if his, his I want y'all to think about it, like really think about it like this. If the woman ain't treating you right, ultimately that means you're not treating yourself right because you tolerating it. How you taking care of yourself but you letting this woman mistreat you? She ain't giving you anything. She taking your money. She taking you. Shoot. Some guys we like time. Sometimes that is the thing. You know? Or the woman ain't she ain't treating you for respect. You know, you out in public with the woman, she check she either 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 in her phone or she checking out other men. She need to hey, if she out with you, she need to be paying a hundred percent attention to you. She need to be she need to be into you. Whatever she do when y'all not together, that's on her. But, guys, you need to think about this. You need to be getting, you need to ask yourself. Some of y'all with a woman there, you ask yourself, what are you getting out of it? What are you getting out of it? You getting something out of it? You know? Is our presence putting more money in your pocket? Is our, is our presence helping you on your mission? Is she in cooperation to your operation? Indeed, sometimes, and really, she in submission to your mission. She helping you out. She's, she say, oh, you doing this? Okay, baby, I got you. Okay, she bringing something. What's she bringing? You know? If you have children with her, is she going to be a good mother? Is she going to be a good mother? You need to ask yourself all these questions. You need to be getting something positive. You need to ask yourself every single time. Sometimes you might have to stop and be like, okay, wait a minute. What am I really getting out of this? I ain't really getting nothing out of this. Ask yourself that all the time, all right? So, anyway, I want y'all to think about that. If you ain't get anything out of it, boom, don't mess with it, all right? So, anyway, that's all I got for now, y'all. I'll get back with y'all later. Peace and blessings. <laughs>